So you may have been wondering where Dad's Talk Tech has been the last few months. Yeah, yeah, you might have been wondering because it has been so long. And I guess all I have to say is... It wasn't my fault! You miserable slug. You think you can talk your way out of this? You betrayed me. No, I didn't. Honest. I ran out of gas. I had a flat tire. I, I didn't have enough money for cab fare. My tux didn't come back to the cleaners. An old friend came in from out of town. Someone stole my car. There was an earthquake. A terrible flood. Locust, it wasn't my fault, I swear to God! <laughs> oh, Jake. Let's go. Yeah, but seriously, uh, the dads in the Dads Talk Tech part of the equation really kicked in as a reason for why it's been a little while. Bruce, you go first. Yeah, so um, both of our daughters are 2022 grads, so we had uh, graduation stuff to plan, uh, parties. We actually drove out to Illinois to the lodge. If you uh, want to see what that looks like, there's an episode all on uh, the uh, lodge where we did the uh, Boca battle. Boca battle, and, yeah. And uh, Keith, your your camera died, and you didn't have that for, geez, months. Uh, yeah. That, that was a big big stumbling block. Part yeah, that was a weird thing that we never really got to the bottom of, honestly. I had my Sony, I have a Sony A6600, and it was plugged into a, uh, a dummy battery plugged into a, the wall outlet, uh, which is what I normally do when we record. But I also, the only thing different is I had a, uh, a separate monitor uh, plugged into it, and I left it on after we had recorded a session and came back couple hours later and the whole camera had died <laughs> so we had to send it in for warranty repairs and that took a long time fortunately it was covered but those of you who have done warranty repairs you probably know you don't get a a detailed report oh here's what went wrong no they yeah. just fix it so they yeah had to go to, to japan too sony in japan to get it fixed the, the warranty company kind of threw up their arms and said yeah sony's got to work on this so that that definitely took extra time so, yeah. you know, long story short, a lot oh. of life kicked in, a lot of dad stuff kicked in. And and squirrels. I had and a squirrels. I had a whole so I record here in my studio above the garage and um, I had a squirrel infestation in the ceiling here which I had kind of been ignoring thinking, "Ah, eh, who cares? I don't really live up here." But then a a raccoon came into the picture and things got rather violent and weird and I started getting damage <laughs> even on the inside so I've been working through a lot of uh, studio issues as well just getting that all taken care of and cleaned up so the good news is as long as it's been uh, Keith has got his Camry back Keith has got his Camry back and and he's uh, you know ready to jump in uh, we have an episode we should be releasing within the next week or so and uh, we have got a full slate of episodes, uh, you know, lined up. We've, we've got plenty of content. A lot of it's recorded. It just has to be edited. Uh, the camera dying actually kept two episodes from being worked on. Of course, the next one is one of those, uh, one of those instances. So uh, we should be good till the uh, end of the year, uh, getting new episodes uh, pushed out. Keith's actually going to be coming into Omaha. We've got something special lined up around that, along with a, an entire week uh, to celebrate our anniversary, uh, three-year anniversary. So we'll get you more information about that down the road. And Keith, any last thoughts? No, just thanks for your patience and thanks for being uh, loyal listeners. I was made for this.